Minister of Foreign Affairs Carl Grenier says the new claim being made by Venezuela on Guyana's territory is the subject of high-level discussion. The claim was made due to the discovery of a significant quantity of oil in the Guyana's internationally recognized territorial waters several weeks ago. Minister Greenwich was quoted as saying, We have, of course, had and continue to have discussion with the Venezuelan ambassador, who is here, with her minister in Caracas, and indeed the president sent an envoy not so long ago, with whom we had discussion and we've had an invitation from UNICER to attend a meeting or to agree to a meeting with Venezuela on the bilateral front. The minister further stated that they will explore all possible avenues and they will make sure that the avenues that should be used will be used. Minister Greenwich made it clear that the area in which oil exploration is currently underway by ExxonMobil has never been the subject of any claim from Venezuela and it is not the repetition of any claim, it is a new claim. The Foreign Affairs Minister added that making this new claim of territory Venezuela has not demonstrated and indeed cannot show any reason for doing so. There is no basis underlying the claim whatsoever in any known formula for allocation of the ocean, save bullyism. The previous tactics of gunboat diplomacy was recalled by Minister Greenwich where in the past the Venezuelan government had no reason for their claim and in return sent a gunboat to seize and claim the territory of Guyana. The minister explained that there is no international principle which says every country in South America must have an Atlantic coast or have sovereignty over some sections of the Atlantic Sea. No law in relation to the Caribbean Sea or the Pacific, so there would be chaos if some president wakes up and says we must have part of the Pacific, Atlantic, or even Caribbean and Pacific. Minister Greenwich emphasized that territorial issues are not a matter for countries to settle unilaterally and noted that unlike most nations, Venezuela is not a party of the Law of the Sea Convention. Reporting for Frontline News, Ricardo Arjun.